Buffalo and Claudine Ewing. Well, we know we all know it's Buffalo and it snows and this city has always taken pride in saying we know how to handle snow, but this last blizzard raised some questions, especially in the city of Buffalo. And today the Buffalo Common Council's Community Development Committee heard from the Buffalo Fire Commissioner about what was done during the blizzard. Remember, there was equipment stuck, firefighters unable to respond to emergencies. Now we're hearing about some real problems in the department from the union. Council Chambers was packed with firefighters today. The council is weighing approving a director of emergency service and a fleet director. Some lawmakers have already taken a stand for one or both. I do think that there needs to be a better organization. Um, I do think that the fleet absolutely needs to be uh, updated. These uh, vehicles, these track vehicles used by county and uh, state agencies and federal agencies as well. And uh, we've actually focused in on, on a few of the models. Uh, some of them are already purchased on the state contract. We need not only equipment and infrastructure, but an emergency management coordinator who will be there, boots on the ground, when the forecasters disaster like the blizzard strike. And we need an emergency operations center to coordinate our response to storms like this. The union says there was a lack of planning and firefighters were dealing with outdated and equipment that was simply down. Coming up at six o'clock, I'll have more on why the union and city say improvement is needed because it is life or death in some cases. Also at 530, you're gonna hear from a council member who's gonna be live in studio for the town hall. I'm Claudine Ewing, Channel 2 News for Most Buffalo. Back to you. Claudine, thank you.